Hi, I'm Seth Perry again with Phillips Craft Care. Uh, we're just like 10 or 12 rows over from our last video. Today is still August 22nd, uh, 2022. Um, so this is kind of a different look at our cover crops. Right now we're standing in a bit of a planter gap. I'd say we're about 100 feet long, roughly. Uh, this is pretty much just a planter error row unit, not dropping seed. You can kind of see it ends back behind me, you know, not 10, 15 feet behind me. But uh, kind of just showing how much thicker our cover crop growth is, like our buckwheat, for example. Uh, in the other video, it was all right around 30 inches tall. This stuff is about 46. And some of this is over four feet tall, on its way to four and a half feet tall. Um, we can kind of look into the canopy too of the cover crop. You can see there is the annual ryegrass is a lot thicker, there's more flax growing. Um, kind of back towards here, there's this rape, of course, is a lot taller right here. Um, so with the more open canopy, there's more sunlight getting down to the plants. These plants are growing a lot more, which is good for cover crops because it's also gonna do its job at shading out plants, weeds such as like, we do have some lambs quarter in here and kind of back behind me is some pig weed, but Relatively, there's a low amount of weed pressure in this area thanks to the cover crops shading out potential weeds.